Welcome to Building Convolutional Neural Networks on Google Cloud. My name's Guy Hummel, and I'll be showing you how to build more complex neural networks and train them on Machine Learning Engine. I'm the Google Cloud Content Lead at Cloud Academy, and I'm a Google Certified Professional Cloud Architect and Data Engineer. If you have any questions, feel free to connect with me on LinkedIn and send me a message, or send an email to support at cloudacademy.com. This course is intended for data professionals, especially those who need to design and build big data processing systems. This is an important course to take if you're studying for the Google Professional Data Engineer exam. To get the most from this course, you should take the Introduction to Google Cloud Machine Learning Engine course before you take this one, unless you already have plenty of experience with machine learning, TensorFlow, and ML Engine. Once again, I'll be showing you how to run examples on ML Engine, so I recommend that if you don't already have a Google Cloud account, then sign up for a free trial. In this course, we're going to work with convolutional neural networks, which have proven to be very useful models for some important machine learning applications. We'll start with an overview of convolutional neural networks. Then I'll show you how to build one using TensorFlow. Next, we'll look at how to improve a machine learning model. First, we'll use TensorBoard to visualize how a model is performing. Then I'll explain the problem of overfitting and different techniques to prevent it. Finally, I'll show you how to scale up your training jobs on ML Engine. By the end of this course, you should be able to build a convolutional neural network in TensorFlow, analyze a model's training performance using TensorBoard, identify cases of overfitting and apply techniques to prevent it, and scale a Cloud ML Engine job using a custom configuration. We'd love to get your feedback on this course, so please give it a thumbs up or thumbs down when you're finished. Now if you're ready to do more with machine learning on Google Cloud, then let's get started.